This episode of the Beauté Industry Podcast was brought to you by Forest, salon software that takes the pain out of managing and growing the salon you've always dreamed of owning. Hello and welcome to today's episode of the Beauté Industry Podcast, your online support community for the professional beauty industry, connecting you with educational pieces, innovative industry products and inspiration from industry experts. I am your host, founding director of Beauté Industry, Tamara Shaw. Today I have with me two guests from Forest Software, Rebecca and Gavin. In today's day and age, the traditional appointment book is out and we are being flooded with salon software programs. However, as per recent conversations in our Beauté Industry Facebook community group, these programs are still not ticking our boxes and meeting our needs, which is where I introduce you to Forest. Forest has one mission and three values. Their mission is to help salon owners get their clients in more often and spending more, which I'm sure we all love. This is one of the reasons why myself and Beauty Industry have chose to partner with the brand over others in the market. I'll let Gavin and Rebecca talk about the features offered, their innovative ways in which they connect businesses to clients and reviews, as well as what they're doing differently in the tech space. From Forest Software, today we welcome Rebecca and Gavin. Welcome, Rebecca and Gavin, to the podcast today. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Our pleasure. Um, So I told the audience a little bit about Forest already, but I'd love for you to give us a brief rundown of the history and the context behind the brand. Yeah, absolutely, um, Tamara. Well, Forrest uh, actually started in the salon environment. Um, the founder of Forrest, um, Ronan Percival, was um, while he was studying at uni, was working on the reception desk uh, in a beauty salon. And he was helping the team there making appointments and they were using a manual process. And then he, he noticed a lot of people not turning up for their appointments. So uh, he thought, well, why, don't, why aren't we messaging these people to confirm their appointments? Mm. And that's basically how Forrest started about 16 years ago. Amazing. Um, yeah, in, in the beauty salon. And then today uh, we've in the, the US, uh, the UK, Europe, um, and now Australia. <laughs> I was over in the UK a um, couple of weeks ago now and as soon as I said the word forest everyone was all over it they were like yes oh my gosh I can't believe you know the brand how do you know the brand in Australia and I think that definitely speaks volume for um, the history and the kind of context of the brand yeah fantastic oh that's good yeah I think um, the word of mouth has been a really big um big driver for Forest is certainly something that we focus on uh, making sure our customers speak positively about us. So, you know, ensuring that we give good service. And then recently we were even endorsed by Forbes, um, the famous Forbes brand um, that rated Forest as um, the number one CRM and salon software. Wow, that's a huge title, number one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what I love about Forest is the mission, and it is quite unique um, in helping salon owners get their clients in more often, spending more, and as you said, kind of closing the gaps that are in the appointment book. Um, I like that there's mention of client retention here, but what I'm wondering is how do you do that? Yeah, so Tamara, one of the tools we have in Forest is called Client Reconnect. And how this works is it actually picks up the customer's individual booking cycle um, and you get this whole dashboard that you can see who's overdue, who's reconnected. So you can actually target them um, when they're, they're, you know, due back in instead of targeting them, you know, after they've kind of decided not to come back, um, which is really powerful. And then that sort of works alongside our new feature, which is called the rebooking SMS. Um, Now, this is, again, off the client's individual booking pattern. So we'll automatically send them a message when they would usually rebook the appointment. Amazing. Yeah. Sorry, were you going to say something there? No, you're right. (laughs) (laughs) Um, So, for example, if I was a client and I went into ABC Day Spa, 
when would I get a email or the text message to remind me that my appointment's due? Does the business owner have to set that or it's just kind of intrinsically within the program? Yeah, it's it just works off like it would work off your booking cycle as, as a client. So, for example, it might send the message to you like five days prior to when you usually come into the salon. So it's actually when you would usually rebook. Amazing. How incredible yes. is that? It's Art, great. Artificial intelligence is smarter than we are. <laughs> Isn't it? It's scary, but it's also a really great tool. <laughs> <laughs> and it also means too, I think, you know, if the client's already booked in their appointment book, they're not going to get these random standard sort of messages that's that right. are very impersonal. They're going to get something that's unique to the actual service mm-hmm. at the time when they are due to have that or a week before they're due to have that service and not in the appointment book. Mm, I think there's nothing worse than getting a text message for a full back wax when you're a woman just thinking they've really (laughs) stuffed up that marketing. (laughs) (laughs) Um, And so we're talking about getting clients to spend more and I'm sure every single business owner who is listening is pricked up when we said that. Um, Can you just unpack this for us a little bit more? Yeah, of course. So one of the tools we help with that is our treat card program. So it's like a loyalty program, but it's a little bit different with how your clients can um, use the points. So they can only use points on products or services that they haven't tried before. And we encourage the salon owners to do that when the client's already coming in for their regular service. So you can say, hey, you've got some points. Do you want to try this add-on service or do you want to try these products that you haven't tried before? Um, And then when they come back in, they'll keep buying that product or they'll keep having that second service that they probably never would have tried or maybe they were getting from another salon. Um, So that's a really powerful tool to increase your average spend but also um, reward your customers. Yeah, I love that because I know a lot of um, day spas and clinics and salon, they often do, you know, purchase four and get your fifth one free or purchase mm-hmm. five, get your sixth one free. But if if it's, for example, five underarm waxes and they're getting the sixth one free, they probably would have still paid for the sixth one. So to give them yeah. something that they, you know, can kind of push them around the spa and we offer so many different treatments these days, face, body, waxing, hair, all of that, um, I think that's a really nice tool. Yeah. Incredible. And so talk to me about some of the features that Forest offers that differs from other software programs because there are lots of them out there. Yeah, I think that's a really good question because I know like, you know, when, you, when you're on the market and you're looking for software for your business, it can be really overwhelming, right? Mm. <laughs> you know, and, and a lot of it can kind of just blend into the same and, and, and even sometimes sadly into the too hard basket. Um, but with Forest, I mean, obviously, there's the things that um, Beck already mentioned, which was the, you know, the predictive text and the machine learning about your client behaviour. Um, and, you know, those sorts of things are pretty unique to Forest. But some of the other features that probably really drives what's important nowadays is uh, what I like to call like the concierge features. Um, so if you imagine tomorrow, like the last time you're in, say, an Apple store, for those who are Apple users out there, mm-hmm. I know there's a lot of Android too, but if you're an Apple user, um, you've been into the Apple store and you see that there's actually no reception desk. There's no cash register. Mm-hmm. Um, and what you're doing there is this, the person that is the, uh, the consultant um, is also the salesperson and they're also the order taker and they're going to check you out as well in the, in the business. And they do that by just using the PDA, which is actually just an Apple phone. And so with Forest, we have a number of features based, or, uh, based around the ability to use our Forest Go app, which is an app that can follow the client around. It can be in your back pocket of the, of the um, therapist or it can be on an iPad, whatever you like. Um, and that just creates that really personal experience. So you can uh, access the client record card. You can do a digital consultation. Um, and the digital consultation is quite a unique feature to, to Forest. So uh, obviously, you know, when therapists are um, sitting with a client, um, there'll be certain questions that they want to ask, um, maybe relating to a particular service, or it might be a digital consultation that they, they want to go through for any new clients that are coming to the spa for the very first time. So within Forest, uh, you, we have the ability for you to create unlimited number of forms and you can assign these forms to either one service or all services. 
And you can even set it so that it only asks the client to fill the form out once or every time they come in for that particular service. Um, what I really love about that feature as well is the security side of things. So before the iPad's handed over, the PIN number has to be put in by the staff member. Um, the client can fill out the form. Maybe there's some really personal, intimate questions that you don't really feel comfortable asking someone directly, but mm. you can ask it via a digital form, okay? Um, and then once the client's entered that information, they can simply just sign off on it with their finger. Uh, that form is then straight instantly uploaded into the client record card. And if you have um, customers that, or tomorrow, if you have, if you have listeners that have more than one location, mm. that form would be available instantly across all branches. Oh, wow. Um, Within the, within the spa brand. So that's pretty cool. Um, and you can build the forms really quickly. You don't need to contact us. You can step your way through it really straightforward. Mm -hmm. another, fe another feature that we really love, um, I found very useful, and we get a lot of feedback from clients, uh, is the ability to take before and after photos. And so that's really good. You know, you're trying to demonstrate to a client about the benefits that they're getting from a particular facial or skin treatment. And if you're taking progress shots along the way, you can actually show them what's happening. And I know that we do that already. Like a lot of people just use their own phone and they'll store those yes. photos. But that's not really secure. And it's sort of, I don't know, it's like merging work and your personal um, photo albums together. So this is a way where it's all stored within Forest before and after photos. And we've just launched actually a new feature. So this will be exclusive to your listeners. Um, we've got a, a portfolio um, folder that's coming. And if clients give you permission, uh, everything goes into that por portfolio as well in a chronological order. So it's not just in the client card, but it's also in this portfolio that the owner then can access if they want to do some digital online marketing, provided they have permission from the client. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And um, with the online reputation, um, is nice. So basically what that does is it takes any reviews that you've received in the business um, that have come back. So they're like, you know, imagine you get out of an Uber and, mm. you, get, you know, you rate the Uber driver between one and five and you leave a comment. Well, we have the ability for all those reviews to be stored within Forest and not public. But then we've got this uh, additional feature that can take those internal reviews and push them online to Google and Facebook. And we've had some customers, uh, Tamara, that, um, you know, they had like maybe three reviews or six reviews over the last 12 months. And when they've implemented the online reputation, they've gone from having six reviews to like having 60 within mm. 12 weeks. And that obviously helps to generate business. And um, sorry, I could talk about a lot of things. <laughs> but one last one, and I'll keep it free, um, just the ability to do the mobile stock take. So uh, it, it turns your ah. mobile phone into a stock take machine. You can scan your barcodes and it updates your, your stock. So, yeah, it's a few things. <laughs> Incredible. So um, with the program being on the iPad or the app, essentially um, one of the biggest things to, well, kind of that inhibits the client from purchasing is that moment where the therapist leaves the treatment room, the client gets up immediately, they've got their keys, they've got their parking ticket, their phone turns on, they've mm. got a thousand text messages. Mm. By the time they get out into the retail area, they're already out, you know, of the whole entire space. So by having it on your phone or the app, the therapist can actually go back into the treatment room and check out the client there. Oh, totally. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's 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 right. So you can actually have you can check the client out right from within the treatment room without even having to leave. Um, obviously, at the moment, you would need some sort of mobile FPOS device or something to yes. take payment. Um, we have some we have a new feature coming out before the end of June, which is called Forest Pay. And that will actually tokenize the credit card at the point they book online. So at that point, when they're in the actual therapist room, they don't even need to reach for their credit card. It's all stored securely within Forest. You can just add the extra skincare products that they want to take home and boom, they get emailed a receipt and then you can book them in for the next appointment. That is so cool. You guys have thought of everything. <laughs> <laughs> and talk to me about the digital consultation because I know this is something that every single clinic spa salon has been asking for the last 10 years. When are we going to go paperless? <laughs> when can we get on digital? However, some brands have done it and it's a bit clunky or, you know, information's lost or it doesn't speak to the mother computer and all of this type of thing. How does it work from your end? Yeah, so I guess 
um, because we're all cloud, just your your last comment there, um, it, 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 it's just all in the one system. Um, when you're making your forms, when you're building them, they're super easy to make and you can choose like what questions are going to be asked, what type of form it is. Um, and then you can assign it to a service like Gavin was saying with the frequency as well. Um, you can actually set up like how many times this form needs to be filled out. So if, you know, or because medical conditions can be developed over time. So mm. you can actually set that up as well and you'll be reminded when a form's due to fill out. Um, it's in the Forest Go app that the customer would actually fill out the form. It comes up on the client's card to say, like, they're due to fill in this form based on what service is booked in. Mm -hmm. So as soon as they fill that form out, it goes straight to the client card. There's no syncing or anything. It's all real time. So it does go straight to the card once it's been submitted and they're super easy to access in the client card. You can click on the link. You can even PDF it if you want, if you need to save it in another like area other than forest. So they're super secure and paperless, which is amazing. Mm, and I think that stops the client from saying, oh, my gosh, I've already filled out that damn client card 20 <laughs> times before. Why are you asking me to do that again? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. And so um, the word cloud, I know, and I'm going to be very general, but in our industry, we are not the most tech savvy. Um, what is a cloud? How does it work? Can you just explain that for anyone who doesn't know? Yeah, sure. Um, I think, you know, you're not the only ones that sort of like, get confused with cloud and all of the different types of options there are out there. Um, so when you're sort of talking software, if you sort of think there's three sort of groups, if you like, currently on the market, there's software which is installed locally on the PC in the salon or the spa, and all the data resides there, everything is there. If that's, if, for example, if that computer was stolen, all the data mm. would be gone. Um, it also means that it's really hard to access it remotely because if someone's using the computer, you can't access it remotely because it's all stored there. Um, then you have this sort of second category, which is sort of still old as well. Um, and it's sort, of old, it's sort of older technology trying to keep up with newer technology where it's still software installed locally, but they're sending some information to the cloud. So it might be a report or, you know, you're trying to access some client information um, and that that's sort of like a, a sort of a, a, an interim step to being 100% cloud. So when we talk about cloud, um, all we're saying there is that really the brains of the computer information is stored uh, remotely on a secure server. So basically, um, just like you'd access um, your information on Facebook or whatever, it's held in a server and it means you can access it from wherever you are. So that gives a lot of flexibility because then everything is in real time. It's held in a secure environment. You can access it from multiple devices um, and it's really convenient. Fantastic. Yeah. So, yeah. So like um, if you think, um, you know, with cloud to like, you know, there's different servers that offer cloud storage. Mm. Um, with Forest, we use the AWS servers, which is the same ones that the, the big banks use. Um, it stands for Amazon um, warehouse servers. Uh, so, yeah, so that's where the data is held. It's held securely, fully encrypted um, and totally accessible. And that's something that I hear a lot, um, once again, from salon owners. You can hear how, how many people are talking about this because it's always a topic that comes up in our Facebook community is that um, they may have an existing program and they only have one license, for example, so that's on their mother computer yeah. and then they're at home yeah. and they've called the software company and they've said, well, how can I get that on my mobile or how can I get that on my PC at home? And the company said, well, that's going to cost you another $2,000 for another license, oh, which is just daylight robbery in my eyes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, totally. Yeah, totally get that. I, look, it's kind of the old way of doing things, to be honest. And, um, you know, with, with like with Forest, you can't really even justify that because it's all held in the cloud. It's really all you want different devices talking to it. So you can't really you know, expect to charge people extra mm. for that. So we just have the we just have a monthly software subscription in our case and that's unlimited number of devices, unlimited number of staff that can all access it in real time. Um, and that's how it sort of 
that's how it, um, you know, it, it works better for people. Incredible. Because you need that. The last thing you want is people congesting at the, uh, at the reception desk on checkouts yes. or you want to access some important information about what the client had done last time, but then someone's at the point of sale using the cash register. It's just so, it's just not efficient. Mm, and you've answered my next question there by saying unlimited devices because that that's what I was going to say. So how many devices? So as many as you want. Mm. As many as you want. So you can use, um, so we've got you know, some situations where, um, actually, I was just speaking to a salon owner recently who owns three spas, and she's um, just fallen pregnant and really looking forward to that stage in her life, but wants to be able to still operate the business and run the business from home. So with, with, with Forrest, she's going to be able to access all the appointment books across the three locations. She's going to do a lot of bookings for the business. She's going to do some financial reporting from home. So that's really given her a lot of opportunities as a stay-at-home mum to be able to, you know, to continue working in her business. Um, and then we've got another situation where um, the accountant and the bookkeeper just wanted access. So they only need access mm. to the financials. So they've got access to that. And then you might have your marketing person or your business coach that, you know, accesses just the marketing. So this is what being cloud-based really frees, um, really frees the sell on, on spa owner up to, to have more flexibility I love that and I love that um, you know it's really giving the business owner kind of power to more so work on the business rather than in the business and you don't have to print mm. a thousand reports and take them home with you and you know realize you printed the wrong one only to go back in the next morning you can just do it all from home <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. Very cool. Um, you touched base on something earlier that we were talking about um, the reviews and so um, kind of pop popping them out onto other platforms. And I know as a business owner myself of different businesses, the reviews are the best thing that gets your um, SEO optimization. And for anyone who doesn't know, when we talk about SEO, it's search engine optimization. So that's Google basically or Yahoo or Bing or whoever you search through. And so if you were to type beauty industry into Google, um, if I'm talking about SEO being good, well, then beauty industry would be the number one kind of clickable search engine that comes up there. So your reviews are the biggest thing that tells Google or the search engine, actually, this business is really active online this is where they are, these are the photos, these are the blog posts, all of the things like that, but the reviews are the thing that consistently pushes your number up um, onto that platform. So can you just dive a little bit further into um, kind of how you get the client to review something and what that process is? Yeah, so we have um, two features. We have one called Reviews and one called Online Reputation Manager. So with your reviews, we get your customers to leave a review after they've left the salon. Now, you can choose if that's sent to them every appointment, max once per month. Um, you can choose the sort of frequency it gets sent to them and you can choose if it's sent via SMS or email. So it's a link they click on and they have the option of leaving a rating and a review. And that review comes into like a dashboard for the salon owner to look at. They can also get sent an email when that review comes in. So maybe if it wasn't a great review, that's a really good opportunity to give them a call, see what happened. They'll probably be a lot less likely to post it on the likes of Google and Facebook. Mm. Um, so that's just the review feature. Now, when that customer is leaving that review to the salon, if that review was five stars, it automatically takes them to another page, asking them to post it onto Google or Facebook. And the review has already been copied for them. They just have to paste it. Um, but it's basically a click. Yes. So easy. Yeah. And as you said, like the more reviews you have, the more activity um, you have, the more likely you are to, be ha to have a better ranking. And with our online reputation feature, we have a dashboard where you can see your Facebook and Google and you can inside that dashboard actually respond to the reviews publicly through there too without having to sign into the different platforms and, you know, responding to those reviews on Google is classed as more activity again. So it's a great tool. That is fantastic. I know um, one recently we have a beautiful wholesale business in our Facebook community and um, she was selling some product and giving out some product at our Beauté Brunch event and she posted in the, in the group about a month after the event and said, 
hi guys, do you mind reviewing um, my product? And a few people said, where's the link? How do we review? Mm -hmm. Lots of different things Mm -hmm. like that. And I think that's the same as well when we're in salon and we're being a business owner, we're saying, okay, well, you know, spread the word. Do you mind saying this? Do you mind saying that? And by the time the client gets home, you know, a hundred million things are going on in their environment. It's just You're something right. that you forget. But if it's that kind of push notification straight to your email or your SMS and then one click and it copies everything onto the platform, that's amazing. Yeah. Absolutely. Very cool. Um, And so one thing that I saw when I was traveling around on your um, website doing a little bit of sneaky peeking is your Salon Mentorship Brother um, program and our beautiful friend Katie Lowndes has featured on there. So tell me all about that. Yeah, look, um, Salon Mentorship Hub is just just another thing that Forrest is trying to do to sort of give back to the industry and connect people and, you know, try and make the whole you know, the whole industry lift, I guess, in a way. Mm. So we've created a, um, a website called salonmentors.forest.com. And basically here, uh, one of your listeners could go, they can click on, for example, Katie's um, profile, and um, they will get a free 15-minute to 30-minute consultation about a subject that they choose. So there's a number of subjects that they can click on. And depending on that, um, they'll be guided towards a particular mentor that can help them with with a free consultation. Mm. So it might be they want to increase retail sales. There might be a staff training um, specialist. Uh, there might be someone who's a specialist in marketing. So they can choose that and then they'll put their details in and then they'll get a, a free uh, session with a professional mentor. Amazing. I think that's really unique. I don't know if there's many other programs doing that. Yeah, well, I mean, look, you know, a forest um, sort of like software is what we, uh, how do you say, how, how do I put this? Like software is the way we deliver our mm. message mm. or what we do. But we are really about back, back to that original question about getting your clients coming in more often and spending more. So we're going to do whatever that takes. If that's connecting people with mentors or getting them to come to one of our summits um, that we, we hold all around the world or the, or the um, Spotify, we have an uh, podcast on Spotify as well Um, yeah this is just another sort of you know arrow in the bow so to speak Mm, incredible and I think that's something um, that I have experienced in my later days of managing and running day spas and clinics in that when something has hit the fan and the computer system is just not working or I can't check clients out or whatever, I'm dialing up the software program and I'm sitting there for 25 minutes on hold (laughs) and, you know, it says press two to leave a message and have someone return your call and you know that no one's ever going to return that call so you don't do it and you just wait there. Um, So the question is how much support do I get as somebody who purchased these programs? So, you mentioned there um, the apps. Uh, so tell me a little bit more about that and your podcast and all of that kind of support. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So with that kind of goes back to Forest's um, core values and the three values that we have as a company are growth mindset, a can-do attitude and service go top, which translate from Irish to excellence in service. Um, so that those three core values is something that really makes us different to the service that we provide um, in Forest. Um, So when you do call us, um, you as the salon owner or the staff member are asked to leave us a rating and that rating gets sent to the whole company. Mm -hmm. So everyone's kind of on their toes, always wanting to provide the best service. Now, all the normal things like you can call us, you can email us. Um, We have then a really cool tool called Help Juice where it, there's like a step-by-step guide which is really easy to access from the software. Um, and then you've also got unlimited online training. Um, so you can actually go into the system. There's a little training tile. You can book training. You can go into classes with other business owners or you can have bespoke training and it's all unlimited. Um, and then we have things like the podcast, as Gavin was saying, so Forest FM, um, which is a podcast um, which is a really cool um, podcast to listen to. There's lots of different guests that come on, um, great kind of um, advice on how to sort of run your business, sharing information, our summit that Gavin spoke about. Um, We have um, user voice, 
So if user voice is like a kind of forum where sal salon owners can go on and vote for something that they maybe want to be oh. developed um, or, so, yeah, and then other salon owners can go on and vote on it and you'll get responses back from development. Um, all of this is free. So cool. I once, yeah. would you believe this, I once paid $3,000 when I was setting up a spa to have four of my staff trained on the computer program. And that right. was not even <laughs> paying for the software. That was just the training, my goodness. Yeah. Uh, well, that's, the, you know, when you get a new staff member, you can just have them, have us train them in the mm. system. You don't have to do it yourself. And it's and they can do it, And they could do it from home they even could. before they start totally. a new business. Uh -huh. Yeah. You just, they can just click on what they need to be trained in and off we go. Yeah. And it is live training like tomorrow. So it's not like it's just a computer generated thing. They're going to join a live class yeah. with three or four other people and they're going to, it might be 60 minutes on marketing yeah. or it'll be stock control. Um, and they just do that module and it's fun because you're with other people. Um, you're with a real trainer, uh, Australian based trainer and, um, yeah, one of the team here based in Brisbane. <laughs> yeah. Vegas. Amazing. And so um, we mentioned stock take before, and that is something that um, I have had a lot of trouble with monitoring in the past. And as well, I might have been at home and I've wanted to place an order, but I don't know how much stock is on the shelves. Um, I can do all of that because it's on cloud with Forest. That's exactly right. So we will actually put in your products for you from your supplier um, set up your minimum and maximum levels so it makes it really easy for you to create your orders and you can do it, doesn't matter where you are. You can even use your app to do a stock take. Mm -hmm. um, I think Gavin mentioned that before. So you can um, do your stock take or your order and send the order off to your supplier. It's super easy. Mm. Yeah, you just, if you weren't in the salon tomorrow, you just need to uh, message the staff, say, hey guys, um, could you please do a stock take using your, your mobile phone before 12 o'clock? Um, once they do that, then they'll, you'll, you'll, that, that would then appear in your uh, when you log on at home and then you could just do your order from there. Very cool. And I love how you're, you're giving the power to the therapist as well and coming back to what you were saying before about the online consultation, or well, not the online, but the um, digital consultation form, um, you really hit home with me in saying that uh, you're mixing personal and professional photos together. So I know a lot of the times uh, the salons and the clinics, they have their uh, computer system software, but then on their personal phone, they've got all of these photos of clients and it's mm -hmm. so inappropriate. And yes. it just, you cannot have that information on your personal phone. So I love that that's all stored within the cloud as well. Yeah, totally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, clients love that feature. Yeah, I can imagine. I would not want my face after my brows have been waxed or after I've had a skin peel all <laughs> red on somebody's personal <laughs> mobile. Yeah, no way. <laughs> and so tell me about um, Forest FM, the podcast. What kind of content's on there and who's that aimed at? Um, Forest FM uh, is just, I think we've just hit our 100th episode, oh, um, which yeah. is pretty cool. Yeah, so that's a weekly podcast. Um, it's got around 25,000 active listeners um, every week. It's, um, it's really short. Like it's, you know, it'll be 20, 30 mm. minutes. Um, there's usually a couple of, usually a guest interview from someone, some, someone around the world um, and they talk about, um, you know, their particular area of expertise and what they're doing. And um, we usually touch on a few things to do with forest. It's not a big product push. It's really about, um, you know, how we can help salons to, you know, get their clients come back more often and spend more money. That's the that's the bottom line with that. And yeah, it's good. And you can listen to it from Spotify. So pretty straightforward. Amazing. And we obviously over here at the Beauty Industry Podcast love podcasts. So <laughs> highly recommend. Yeah. Well, we'll uh, we, well, I'm sure we'll be able to get you on there as a guest. We'll we'll, we'll put. Well, that would be great if you could join us on um, yeah, Spotify. Oh, how kind. I would love that. And so I'm sure the burning question that everyone is yelling at me through their cars is how much, because this sounds incredible. So what is the investment for business owners? Yeah, so um, we just follow like a, a monthly subscription for our software, which gives you unlimited number of devices, unlimited number of staff, et cetera. And we charge that per location. So um, if you've got one location, it'll be um, – you know, one amount and if you've got two, then you just pay it twice, mm -hmm. right? So 
Um, it's between $35 a week and $66 a week for the software with all the bells and whistles. Very cool. And yeah. So, yeah. So essentially you're looking at between $150 per month um, up to $267 per month plus GST. Amazing. Super affordable. I'm sure we'd all spend $15 at lunch in the food court a day. So <laughs> exactly right. Yeah. Yeah, and some of the things around the predictive text that we spoke about where you're getting, you know, clients that weren't booked in for appointment reminding them, that, hey, Ga- hey, Gavin, you're, um, you're due for your facial or um, the online reputation, which is building your SEOs. I mean, you only need one visitor who's from out of town logging onto Google, seeing that you've got the most number of reviews booking in and you've already paid for the software. Mm, Yeah, you're 100% right. Um, And so we are going to host a forest and beauty industry webinar uh, on Tuesday, March 12th, and that's 7 p.m. Brisbane time, 8 p.m. Melbourne, Sydney time. Um, You guys are going to log in there and kind of give us a little rundown and a preview of the forest app and the software system and show people how to use it because I guess um, a lot of us you know it's all good and well to hear about it but we want to see the program we want to see the functionality and things like that so it's very cool yeah well um, I'll be uh, I'll be on that um, webinar but I'll be handling handing that one over to Beck Um, Beck's got a lot of experience started out as in uh, your your trained beauty um, you're a therapist yeah Yeah, worked uh, in in spas and across uh, New South Wales and Queensland. So yeah. um, Beck's going to run that one and, uh, yeah, show you some of the unique features within Forest. Incredible. So um, for anyone who's listening, if you're wanting to jump on that webinar, I'll pop it in both our Beauty Industry Pro membership forum so you can travel along and click the links as well as in our Beauty Industry Facebook community. So if you're not in either of those, please jump on and find your way to the link and um, you can jump in and watch it as well. And so, Gavin and Rebecca, thank you so much. Can you tell us where we can find out more about Forest? So social media, website, emails, all of the good stuff. Yeah, look, I think probably the, um, to forest.com. Yeah. Uh, just, just check that out. Um, if you like YouTube, go and check mm. out the YouTube yeah. channel. There's, a, there's so much great content on there. We've got a full-time video department doing videos every week. So check that out. And, of course, um, you can listen on Spotify or other blog websites for our, um, our podcast. Yeah, and on our website you can um, request a demo or quote and one of us can get in touch with you as well. Amazing. And so forest is not the normal forest greenery forest spelling. No. <laughs> How do we spell that? <laughs> Yeah, that's right. It's um, it's spelled P H O R E S T. Beautiful. So forest, forest dot com. P H O R E S T. Excellent. Yep. So if you're searching for forest on social media, um, YouTube, <laughs> Google, whatever you're doing, it's forest with a P H, so that you don't end that's up good. looking at photos of pine forest (laughs) beautiful well thank you guys so much for your time today i truly appreciate um all of your knowledge and insight and as i said in the introduction i don't often partner with software companies because i haven't found one that i am obsessed with yet Um, however this is definitely ticking all of those boxes so i appreciate all of your work and Um, listening to the industry and listening to business owners and their needs and um, then actioning that. It's really great. Thank you. Thanks for the opportunity to talk uh, with you and your listeners. Thank you. Pleasure. Between the client reviews, auto reminders, digital consultation forms and the unlimited training and support, it is so time for a software program like this to exist in our industry. Just to clarify, the name was Forest with a PH and Forest have been kind enough to provide the listeners of the Beauty Industry Podcast with a 50% discount off the setup fee when you become a Forest client, which will save you dollars better spent elsewhere. You'll find a link in the show notes that will directly provide you with a discount upon booking a consultation with Rebecca and Gavin. Also in the show notes is a behind the scenes look at the program that we were lucky enough to record together to give you a visual tour of the appointment system. So be sure to jump in there and have a look around. Until next time, stay connected.